Hello everyone, how are you today? Um, well, let me introduce myself. My name is Manuel Arzola. I am from Puerto Varas, uh, which is south of Chile. And I just want to show you some places in this area that I just love. And I think after this meeting, you are going to love them as well. Okay, let me share my screen and I can give you some more details about it. Um, okay, uh, maybe you're thinking with your wife or your husband or your girlfriend or your boyfriend, that special person. You're looking for a quiet place with a beautiful scenery, um, very nice people, uh, very nice meals. Uh, and I think this is the place you need to be. Um, because if you want to take some pictures in the sunset or maybe just walking around into the handcraft market, uh, just playing with the snow in the Son Volcano, or just take the ferry boat to get into the Chiloé Island. Well, these are some of the excursions that we have in this area. Um, but first of all, some information. Um, you, as you can see on the map, we are located in the south of Chile, and just 1,000 kilometers away from Santiago. And we are just close to Argentina and also some other places like San Carlos de Bariloche. Um, so we are around, we, Puerto Varas has around 60 meters above the sea level. Uh, while climate is the temperate rainforest, which is um, obviously we have a lot of rain around 150 days with rain per year. Well, obviously that's why all the green. Just hold on just one second because I'm going to show you some pictures about that. Um, okay, blah, 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 blah. So what can we do, right? Oh, that's a fair question. Um, that's this is one of the, um, the outstanding attraction that we have in this area is the Sorno Volcano. It's the first one that you saw in the, in the picture. Uh, this is excursion who visit three points, three points into the Vicente Pérez Rosales uh, National Park. Um, the Sorno Volcano, the Petroguer Waterfalls, and the Todos Los Santos Lake. So you have uh, wonderful views of the Tanquiwe Lake, one of the uh, biggest in this in South America. And uh, inside the national park, you have some trails where you can you can walk by your your husband, your wife, um, and it's a quite a good excursion to be in, to get in touch with the nature. So that's a great excursion. It's a half day excursion. Uh, and these are the pictures, you know, the Osorno Volcano, which is the outstanding attractions that, as I said, and uh, it's considered one at the starting point from the Patagonia, which is uh, the, the Chilean Patagonia. Um, in the center, of these uh, pictures, you have the, the waterfalls. Um, in winter time, as I said, uh, you have the snow, um, but you have in the Sono Volcano, you, you, in, in, in the top, you can find glaciers. So, so you have uh, snow the all year round. And um, it's, it's in, in, imagine just to stay there. So uh, it's, it's a quite an, uh, uh, an experience to be to be here. Well, that's one of the excursions, but we have another one, which is the Chiloé Island. I just talked to you about something, just take the ferry boat to get into the Chiloé Island. Chiloé, it's, it's, it's a magical island because in one side, in one hand, you have these churches, you have this uh, story about the people who live there 
and and and, and what they um, believe because you have some leprechauns uh, stories about leprechauns you have a ghost ship so it's quite an interesting thing witches a lot of witches uh, but it's quite it's it's um, a, a very nice excursion it's a whole day excursion but it's a beautiful one so the churches as i said there's a museum there is the the nice palafitos uh the handcraft market the fish market also so it's a quite an experience to get into the chiloe island um well if you want to take some termas um, if you want to spend the, the, the time into the pools, for instance, you have uh, in this particular thermal, thermal spa, um, you have 10 pools, thermal pools, with a thermal mat. Also, there's a cafeteria inside, so you can take um, just um, a nice uh, trip from Puerto Varas, getting into the Ensenada. Ralun, Cochamo, Puelo, get into the Termas del Sol. They spend just around just four hours to get in uh, inside the Termas del Sol. And after that, we're going back. So it's a nice experience. I can show you these pictures. Um, this, as I said, there's uh, 10 pools, thermal pools inside where you can have temperatures from 35 to 45. So Celsius degrees. So it's it's quite an experience, and you have also, as I said, a cafeteria inside, when you can take some soups and sandwiches and pizzas and everything. Um, it's a quite um, um, a, a very good excursion if you want to take some relaxing time. This is the place you need to be. Well, after that, if you want to take a uh, just a trail um, and you just want to, you want to walk inside the national park. Well, this is the place, the Alerce Andino uh, in national park. It's close to Puerto Varas. We are going down from Puerto Varas to Puerto Montt. And after that, we're getting into the Alerce Andino. And what we can see is this, obviously, this antique um, tree, the, um, the Alerce. Um, um, there's, there's a walking around one hour, one hour and a half, walking to get into this old, um, where you can see those ladies who are trying to hug the, the, the tree. You need more than 10 persons to do that. <laughs> um, but it's quite beautiful to get into the nature, walking, walking inside this path. Um, it's um, to get in touch with the nature. Um, it's quite an experience. Well, another excursion that you can do, it's a half the excursion, it goes to Frutillar and Puerto Octay. You know, starting in 1850, uh, there were German settlers in this whole area around the lake. So um, we have their traditions, their gastronomy, I mean, their homemade beers also, very good. <laughs> so this is a very, um, I think it's, it's, it's the one that you, you can see of uh, views of the volcanoes because in this area we have the Osorno volcano, we have the Calbuco volcano, the Tronador, which is half Chilean, half Argentine, and the Punte Agudo. And this is one of the excursions you can see all those volcanoes. And besides that, the Yanquiwa Lake. So you have in Yanquiwe, which is the first town, um, you, it, it, this, this is the first picture. Uh, at your left and the way uh, in the top. Um, and after that, we're going to visit um, Puerto, sorry, uh, Frutillar, where you have a museum, you have a theater over there. 
And uh, finally, we get into Puerto Octay, and you have amazing views of the Azorno Volcano and Yenkewe Lake. So it's um, historical, but it's also with a very nice views. Um, well, obviously, those are some of the excursions that we have. And, uh, and I just uh, love to, to be with you uh, and this uh, at this meeting to show you these places. And, and uh, finally, I just want to, um, I just want to say that thank you for this um, time that I can show you these places. I just talked to you about it. It was like 20 years ago um, that I just uh, came here. And um, I never went out. So it's quite an, an amazing experience to be here. And I think you're going to, to spend the most wonderful time here. So um, be welcome whenever you want. So bye-bye and have a pleasant day. <laughs>